<laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, can you imagine going through life in a cubicle and all that? I mean, I I, I used to work in uh, corporate America. It was it was not easy. I need a clip of Mark farting on Yamanika and then being like, "I'm dialing it back." <laughs> <laughs> this is me. This is the buttoned up me. I was gonna piss in her mouth. <laughs> imagine farting on Yamanika. <laughs> oh, it was terrifying. She was not happy. I was. There was a risk. It was a real it risk. It was a risk that Did paid off. Did you get off. rewarded? Oh, she flipped. <laughs> oh, jeez. She flipped, but we got the clip. Well yeah. said. Um, <laughs> child, Mark, I can't take... This that is what I'm talking one. about. This is some one. shit you'll Mark. never see on a black podcast. She's trying to talk about her journey to weight loss. Put poot out of his ass. <laughs> and he know I'm the wrong one to do that shit, right, too. Right. I went and took a shower to come here <laughs> from the gym. And you going to uh, raise your little stink yeah. ass up. Yeah, but and thanks for shooting in my and direction, Mark. put it in your damn yeah. eyeballs. That's crazy as hell. And this is exactly why people be getting murdered on the train because of <laughs> shit like that. That's insane. Insane, you know. All right. you We're all adults here. Insane, Mark. Uh, you, if you have I to go, feel free. It. And, it, and you heard how it came out like it was surprise. It, yeah. it, it was surprise. It was it like. Was- it was, you know what it was? It was like, it was like a fart the way a guy would like peek behind the door. <laughs> right, <laughs> right, because it kind of saw me out it. here. Yeah. was like, not why this black lady's here, but we already being pushed out. I treat everyone equally. That's why I thank you, but also I'm offended. Oh, um, it's out of love. I didn't. No, I, I appreciate a, No, no, that's the. It's the, a comfort thing. Of course. Yeah, it doesn't smell great either. But I, I can't honest. talk about Sorry. food now with this, mm. you know, Sorry. shit lingering in the damn air. <laughs> that's yeah. crazy. Well, that's fun. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Nate was another one did not like the fart. Oh, do you see that clip? I did, yeah. You know, because you're like, I mean, the, the closer you can get to your real life, the more, uh, I think, the more material you, you're you open to. Oh, yeah. Because you're just being you. So it's, you know, the more you can just do this, the more you'll be able to talk about, the more, you know, it's, it, 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 it's more conversational. It's more mm. whatever it is. Right. Hold on. All right. But let me just say this. I had nothing after that. Yeah. But uh <laughs> sorry. That was a squeaker. Yeah. We had uh, we had Jewish deli before this. Sorry about that. Oh no, you're good. Can uh, I? He farted. It was a whole thing. Did he? Yeah, yeah. Nate did? I know. No. Supposed to be clean. No. Yeah. <laughs> I, want, I want Mark to have a sitcom just so actors have to walk in and he farts and they have to yeah. pretend they like it. <laughs> yeah. Shoot him a Gavin's like that's very funny. Yeah. He'll be he'll be kicked <laughs> off like Patrice on the office. Ah. <laughs> <Just> immediately. <laughs> yeah. Nate, no, that, that's not Nate's it's cup of so tea. It's so funny. There's people that actually cannot stand farting. Oh yeah. Well, Louis, I told you, Louis, uh, we've been close for a long time. I've never heard him fart one. He's never once lifted a leg and been like, Burp. and we were at the uh, like. Four seasons, first night on the tour for Mark. <laughs> I'd been on the tour for a while. I got to know the man, and we were in his room. And Mark just went on his bed and rolled over, put both ankles. <laughs> it just goes. <laughs> I thought and he Louis it. was on the phone with room service, ordering food like this. <laughs> yeah, that was that's tough. a hard bomb. Yeah. Hard. Oh, there's a clip so of Louis. It. There's it's a so clip funny. of Louis now it is. on the Daily Show back in the day where Louis like, if you don't find farts funny, there's something wrong with you. Thank you. Well, I think he, uh, maybe he thought it was funny. I don't know. Maybe he was ordering, uh, you know. I think it was the bed. I'm on his bed. The, the bed and yeah, the fact that he's ordering food. Yeah, right. and the or legs, the kimbo. It's just like your poo particles everywhere. Yeah, I was <laughs> naked, too. Well, and, uh, at that point, I think you guys had spent like 80 minutes together. Yeah. It wasn't like your old pals. Yeah. <laughs> You've taken some real fucking risks. Well, I'm a comedian. I love it. You I take mean, risks, but, but yeah. It, that is a big swing. Well, remember that Curb episode where he's like, your wife? Oh, no, your kid. He's got a pretty big dick. And he's like, how could you say my kid has a big dick? He's like, you can say my wife has nice dick. <laughs> and then later, Jeff is like, why would you say his kid's got a big dick? He goes, I took a risk. <laughs> and I've never related to a, a moment more in that show. Well, I remember Colin not liking you from the get-go yeah, at Whiplash. Yeah. Wayne didn't like you? Yeah, well, because DePaulo did Whiplash, if you can believe that. Wild. Which is insane. What? Yeah. Well, it's colliding. And then Mark went on after and was like, yeah, oh, this fucking Italian, whatever, whatever you said. And Giddy Colin was up. like, who the fuck is this kid? <laughs> zinging Nick DiPaolo. What is he, crazy? You don't do that. That's nuts. And he's like, I hope this kid dies. And But now, now you guys are cool. Yeah, now Nick, cool. Nick likes you too now, right? Oh, yeah. We go way back. Big time. Yeah. We talked. <laughs> <laughs> We've had some good calls. No. But I mean, now who knows where he is now? No, he's great. He's on the Capitol steps or what? <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, Nick. 
Two of the kings. He probably is there. I don't know. <laughs> He's Who listening knows? to this. He's like, I'm going to fucking kill that kid. <laughs> oh, people will message me every once in a while and be like, you got to stop. You can't have this man in your life, you piece of shit. He's good uh, on Twitter every now and then. Like, he'll zing Lewis or something, and it's pretty funny. Oh, he's great. He's going to Skankfest. Oh, great. All right. I can't wait to see him. 